Hey everybody, I want to introduce myself. I'm Coach Cavanaugh. Uh, I teach at Cedar Creek here in Ruston, and I'm going to be the educator for Lincoln Parish's A Heck of a Summer program. And I want to just take a second to introduce myself and give you sort of the main uh, spiel before we get into interviews, which will save us a little bit of time. Um, we will be conducting interviews virtually beginning next Thursday on April 29th, and you should be receiving an email that will have a Calendly link in the email, and you simply just click that link, pick the day and the time that works for you, and then that will create a Zoom link uh, that you will be able to click on when our meeting shows up, and each of those uh, interviews should last anywhere between 10 to 15 minutes, and they'll be done individually. I also have a few questions on there that I'd like you to answer for me um, when you click on that. Just do you think you'll be available for our dates? Will you have transportation? Um, any conflicts that may be showing up? Because we want to make sure that uh, we have an opportunity to figure out what everybody's plans are for the summer. Um, so real quick, the dates for the program will be June 14th through July 2nd. Uh, a very typical day, the way we have it planned out now, is you will be able to go into the uh, hospital and do rounds, unlike we were last year. So that's a very exciting thing for our students this year. Um, the program is about 100 hours over those three weeks. And the way we have it mapped out right now is each morning you would arrive at the hospital before 8 a.m. and do two sections of what are called rounds, where you're going to get hands-on experience at the hospital, touring different sections of the hospital, pharmacy, uh, ER, radiology, cardiology, med surge, all those types of places. And you would go through a couple of rounds there at the hospital from 8 to noon each day. And we're looking at, at tying in a hybrid model because we, we learned some really great things last year doing this virtually. And you would have about an hour lunch from 12 to 1 to travel home. And our virtual class will take place from about 1 to 3.30 or 1 to 4 o'clock each afternoon. So there will be some time spent at the hospital and some time spent at home. And, and there's a few reasons for that that we can get into a little bit later. But we want to make sure that you guys know what the dates are, June 14th through July 2nd, to make sure that you are available every single day. You get a half a credit on your high school transcript for this. And so attendance is mandatory every single day. Can't be late. Have to be there. We treat you like adults uh, and like it's a job for three weeks in your summer. So we take this very, very seriously. There are a ton of applicants, and we are only able to uh, take 12 uh, individuals this year due to um, some COVID and hospital restrictions. And so there's a lot of people applying. It's a really great opportunity, a really great program, but it's very competitive. And so we want to make sure those that are selected are actually able to show up and can complete, not just do the, the program, but complete it and get something out of it. Because if you are selected, you are taking a spot from somebody else. And so we want to make sure that that, that is very important. And we want to make sure that you know that uh, up front. And so we want you to think about, can you do those days? Are you out of town? Is there a church trip, a family vacation? Do you play sports where you're going to be required to work out? Uh, do you have a job? Do you babysit? Do you have to watch after a little brother and sister? All, all of that life stuff can pop up. And we want to make sure that you're able to commit to the program. And if you are selected uh, and you can't do that, it is okay to tell us no and turn us down. Um, and we can move on to a, a series of alternates that we will have. Um, and so, again, we just want to make sure that you, you are into the idea and that you can commit to the program um, because it is extremely competitive. And there is there's a lot uh, sort of required of you throughout the program. But it's a really great opportunity, uh, awesome opportunity. Some other things that we get to do outside of just hands-on at the hospital, we have a ton of different speakers that we get access to to learn from, ask them questions, ER doctors, surgeons, people that work in oncology, people that work on the business side of things. Uh, there, there's so many things that you can get involved in in the medical profession, and we want to expose you to as much of that as, as possible. Um, so there will be some, some speakers, some lectures, uh, lots of group discussion with me. There will be a lot of journaling, uh, writing down what you learn and your experiences. There are some uh, – so as your educator, I'm basically in charge of your grade. And there are certain things that we have to do, uh, requirements for your grade. There will be a couple of medical terminology exams that we have to do, which we can get into that a little bit more. Uh, those aren't too, too bad. Um, we do uh, something called an anatomy T-shirt. We do a couple of workshops for suturing. Vital signs, you get certified in CPR. Um, you know, we'll have, a, like I said, a couple of group discussions on some ethical issues. 
Uh, we build resumes. We do some research on jobs and diseases that you might be interested in. And so there's lots of really great stuff. It's a very well-rounded opportunity and experience uh, throughout your summer, but it is a commitment. You are giving up three weeks of your summer, but I do think that, that any, I, I've taught this for, I think, six summers now, and everybody that goes through it talks about how amazing it is, and nobody's ever regretted uh, going through that. So, and from what I can tell, we have a really great stack of applicants from from what I've looked at um, so far. So, uh, hopefully, this has just given you a little bit of information um, that's going to save us some time when we get to our interviews. So, I thank you for taking the time to go through this, watch it once, watch it twice, um, whatever you need to do. Um, the orientation dates for this will be. May 19th, which I believe will be at the hospital. And that's where if you are selected, you show up for an orientation and we meet some more people that will be working with us. Ms. Casey Baxter is going to be our person at the hospital. Tashonda Tolliver is our rep through AHEC, getting your scrub sizes, doing a lot of, you know, getting the, the necessary paperwork filled out, all of that sort of red tape stuff to make sure that we're ready to go uh, for the actual, actual program. So uh, again, thank you so much for just taking a look at this. This By you watching this video and getting a little bit of this background, that's going to save us a few minutes during everybody's interview, uh, which means that you and I are going to get an opportunity to get to know each other a little bit better and kind of get down to why you want to do uh, AHEC. And that'll be one of the questions that I'm going to ask everybody. Why are you interested in doing this? What are you hoping to get out of this experience? Uh, do you know what you want to do? Or are you interested in something in the medical field? Um, and why do you think you would be a great candidate uh, for AHEC and not just get something out of it for yourself, but what could you bring to the other 11 people that are going to be in the group? And so we'll get an opportunity to talk about that uh, beginning next week. So if you've found this, you've gotten the email, please go check the Calendly link, sign up for a time. Please make sure that you're there and you're on time. Um, and I'll make sure that you guys have my uh, email address in that. That if you need to contact me directly about something or something comes up, you'd be able to let me know. Um, but I'm looking very much forward to meeting each of you, uh, getting an opportunity to connect with you and learn something about you. And I'm very excited about AHEC this summer and getting back in the hospital and making sure that we give you guys the best possible experience that we can. Um, and hopefully I will see a lot of you very, very soon. Thank you.